everybody, it's Mickey, and in today's video we are talking about the four products that can help you clean your home from top to bottom. By popular request, I am going to share with you how I put together my DIY cleaners and some of the supplies that I use when I clean my house. I do use some store-bought cleaners that work really well for me when I have a really big job to do, but these DIY cleaners are the ones that I use weekly to clean my home. So what you will need is some baking soda, which is a non-toxic mild alkali that actually makes dirt and grease dissolve, white vinegar, which is acidic and can dissolve soap scum and hard water buildup, some alcohol, which is a natural disinfectant, and Dawn dishwashing liquid, which is a gentle cleaner, but powerful enough to cut grease. I have a free printable for you down below in the information section that has 12 DIY homemade cleaner recipes. These recipes are for things like a gentle all-purpose cleaner, furniture spray, laundry brightener, and a natural toilet balm. This printable will also be available on my blog at mybestfullife.com. My favorite kind of containers to use for my mixes are empty Mrs. Meyer spray bottles. It's always best to upcycle something that you already have in your house. I did find these beautiful spray bottles at the Target dollar spot for a dollar, so I did pick up a few of them. So here I am making cleaner for my granite countertops. I always start off with about a cup and a half of warm water and then I add a teaspoon of Dawn dishwashing liquid and about a fourth of a cup of alcohol for a disinfectant. Shake it up and it's ready to use. The all-purpose cleaner that I use throughout my house is just about two cups of warm water and a teaspoon of Dawn dishwashing liquid. For the bathroom, I have the recipe for my homemade toilet bombs. If you would like to see that full video, I will leave a link to it up above. I've also included the recipe for my bathroom scrubby cleaner. Two of my favorite cleaners that I use all the time are the faux flower plant cleaner and the furniture dusting spray. You can find variations of all these cleaners online. I have included the recipes for those cleaners that I use and that work best for me. I have gotten a lot of questions about the supplies I use to clean with and some of my favorite products come from the dollar store. These little scrubbers and dusters are great for those spots that are just out of reach. I just love this microfiber dusting mitt that you can find in the automotive section at the dollar store, along with these different cleaning cloths and microfiber cloths. I like to use them so much because if they get really, really dirty, you can just toss them out. They've only cost you a dollar. These little sponges are such a great deal. They come in a package of six for just a dollar. I like using these smaller microfiber sponges to get into all those little smaller spaces. And I always pick myself up a pack of toothbrushes and toothbrush cases. They are perfect for those little scrubbing jobs around your sinks and faucets. I carry it all around with me in these little cleaning caddies that I found at Walmart for just a couple dollars. I keep one upstairs and one downstairs. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today and I hope you enjoyed this video and got some good ideas on how you can make your own DIY cleaners. Leave me a comment down below if you have any questions or video ideas. And please don't forget to subscribe. I put out new videos every week on decorating, organizing, and taking care of your home. So until I see you in that next video, I hope that you love the life that you have and I will see you again soon. Bye!